I'm back again and this time I have my mineral pigment which is called Sexy and just tip a little bit into the pot and I'm taking the bigger of my two brushes and just tapping it off in the lid and then I'm just going to apply it under my brow. It's a nice little highlighter this one. I sort of think it will come out more pink, but it doesn't. But it does give a little glimmer to the eye. And I always put it all over the eye so that I can blend it with everything else. And then I've got a smaller brush. I'm just going to do in the corner with the little tear ducts go. And just brings out your eyes a little bit more. Always tip the remainder back in your container and then this one is vulnerable which is quite a pink colour but doesn't come out too pink so I'll just tap that off and I'll just show you let's take it over the middle and into just into my eye a little bit this is very light makeup. I don't do heavy during the day. So that's it for the minerals. These last for ages because you only need a tiny little bit in the lid. And, I, and um, I've had these for three months now, and they're still full. Okay, so, I'm going to set that all off, the piece de resistance. I'm going to show you my magic mascara, 3D mascara. So, I just put the implant gel on. And I go right underneath the lashes when I put the first layer on. You can use a layer of your own mascara if you want to. I just think that's a waste of money. You might as well use what you've got. And because this is all natural product, I have found that my own eyelashes have grown. Then I take the fibres and just put them on the ends of the eyelashes and watch them grow. Which is really good fun. First time I used this, I nearly crashed the car because I kept looking in the mirror to see how long my eyelashes were. Then you get used to them and you think, oh my God, they're not long enough anymore. And you keep applying it and you end up with enormous eyelashes and look ridiculous. But on a night out, who cares? So then you go back over with the implant gel very important and that gives you the setting for your eyelashes. There's a little trick you can do with a hairdryer. If you put it on warm and face it upwards under your chin that will curl your eyelashes but I'm not going to do that. So there you can see one without, one with, totally different. And just because I've got you all on video, I'll just do another layer, just to show you. So that's the fibres, right on the tips. And the implant gel on top. Okay, so there you go. Magic Mascara and it is worth every penny. See you soon.